In this question, we're asked to find the equation of the line through the two points, negative 2 comma 5 and 4 comma negative 3 in point slope form. We start by recognizing that in order to find the equation of the line in point slope form, we're missing the slope. So we can do that, or we can find it, by using the slope formula m equals y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. And if we were to replace the respective values in there, y2, which is negative 3, minus y1, which is 5, over x2, which is 4, minus x1, which is negative 2. Distributing the negative and combining the numerator, we get negative 3 minus 5 as negative 8. Negative times a negative is positive, so 4 plus 2 gives us the 6. This fraction can be reduced into negative 4 thirds, which is our slope. Now at this stage, we have the slope and we have an embarrassment of riches. We have two points when we just need one. So pick one. It doesn't matter which one you pick, but if you were to use, let's say, the first point, negative 2 comma 5 in the equation of this line, the equation would turn out to be y minus y1, which is 5, equals m, which is the slope negative 4 thirds, times x minus x1, which is, negative, uh, which is the x-coordinate, negative 2. The negative and the negative can get multiplied to give a positive. So if we had used this first point, negative 2 comma 5, and the slope we found, negative 4 thirds, the equation turns out to be y minus 5 equals negative 4 thirds times the quantity x plus 2. On the other hand, if we had used the other point, 4 comma negative 3, we would just replace, make the appropriate replacements. y minus y1, which is negative 3, equals m, which is negative 4 thirds, times the quantity x minus x1, which for us is 4 for this point. We can multiply these two negatives and get a new equation, y plus 3 equals negative 4 thirds, times the quantity x minus 4.